Welcome back to Operations Challenge. Our next event is the Godwin Maintenance Event. This event might hit home for a lot of viewers as this event tests operators' ability to repair a pump that is out due to severe weather. The maintenance portion of the WebTech Operations Challenge is focused on the routine maintenance and operation of the Godwin NC 84 inch by 3 inch pump in preparation for use at a lift station. Transportation and installation at the lift station including programming for emergency use. with the Sludge Hustlers. How are you guys doing? Good. 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 You just finished the pump maintenance event, right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah. How did it go? Uh, I think it went well. You know, we didn't. We avoided making any big mistakes, and uh, you know. So what does it entail? Uh, well, basically, it's a, a lift station, and one of the pumps that, at the station is uh, is down. So we take apart a pump, put it back together, and then wheel it in and re and fix the problem. So you each have a different role to play, right? Yes. What did you do? Um, I, I work on the volute side with the uh, ball check. Um, Anthony's our station guy. He's the guy we make run back and forth nice. everywhere. The yes, yes. <laughs> you know, I set up the hoses, you know, grease the engines, gre uh, grease the tires, repair the tires. We all, um, we all have a bunch of stuff to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what was your time? We ran 451. 451? Yes. That's super quick. Yes, it was. Very it was. impressive. You got like you work up a lot of sweat doing these things today, yeah, huh? Obviously, yes. Mental sweat yesterday, physical sweat today. Yeah, so yeah. yeah. That's well, cool. we're excited. We'll see you at the awards then. Great, thank, thank you. Thank you, thank you guys. Thank you. We had a chance to stop by the pump maintenance event and talk to Chris. How are you? Good, thank you. How are you? I'm doing great, thank you. So tell me a little bit about what you do here at this event. So I am uh, one of many volunteers, and uh, we judge the maintenance event. So the teams come together. In this specific event, they. Uh, check out a pump, so engine uh, and the pump in itself, uh -huh. and then they take it to a pump station, uh, which has simulated a failure on one of the pumps at a submersible pump station, and they put together a temporary bypass. Okay. Um, so we, four judges at a time, uh, we watch multiple things that they're doing all at once to make sure they're doing it uh, safely and properly, uh -huh. um, and, and judge them accordingly and, and time them as well. How about how many judges uh, judge this event? So there are uh, four booths running at once, and there are typically anywhere from four to five judges per booth. So you're looking at 20, 25 people, uh, give or take, if there's any swing judges, so we can rotate out and get a break every once in a while. Yeah, that would be nice, right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so how, where do you get these pumps? So every four years, uh, we change the format. So uh, this is the last year for the Godwin pump. Okay. Um, so the, uh, Godwin's actually one of the sponsors uh, for this event, and I believe next year it's going to be uh, KSB, an electric submersible on a control panel. Um, so a lot of the uh, exhibitors here at the uh, conference um, put uh, together their own time or submit to be a sponsor for the event, for the maintenance side. Super exciting. Yeah, absolutely. How do you feel that operators benefit from participating in Operations Challenge? Well, that's a great question. Uh, it really brings together a whole plan uh, because this is just one of a number of events. So your maintenance division, you know, this is their specialty. but. The other operators and the people working the, the plant and labs and everything else all have to come together to do this event. So there's a lot of cross training that goes on uh, yeah. and everybody has to come together and work together. Uh -huh. So you get an appreciation for if you're you know, in the maintenance division and you have to do the lab work, it makes you appreciate what they do at, at the plant and vice versa. For the lab people that don't go outside or don't do the maintenance side, they appreciate everything that goes on for the whole operation to work. Wow, that's so interesting. Yeah. Wow. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing you next year in New Orleans, Great. so uh, thank, thank you. you for taking the time to talk to us. Absolutely, thank you.